Our government puts economy before humanity. And until we put humanity first, we will always see corruption. We will always see separation. We will always see the interests of big business above the interests of humankind. And that cannot be acceptable. It serves big business and it serves our political system to keep us numb and dumb and disconnected from even our own common sense. And it's necessary at this point to recognize that the more that money plays into our politics, the more that it's going to contribute to very manipulative rhetoric to keep us seduced into thinking perhaps they're doing the right thing, but they're doing the right thing to serve those who are funding these political interests. If citizens recognize that we have the power to actually initiate change, but it requires us to look at our own disconnection from society, our own apathy towards humanity. When we awaken from that sleep that we're in and take accountability and responsibility for the ways in which we disengaged, change would be inevitable, peace would be inevitable. But it really does require an individual revolution. The through line is love.